Okay, get a little bit more. Bring it down. Bring it down. And you want to buff it. I got a big nose, so I like to contour my nose. Get a little bit more in the V. Why is going out my camera? It's doing some crazy lighting back there. Let me get really close here. So you can see my schnazola. I know what I'm saying. V. It's a Marilyn Monroe trick. Did you know that? Mmm. Learn something new every day. <laughs> you can put a little under here. Make your lips full. You see? You kind of like see the lines, but you want to blend. I like to put a little bit more. It's because I got my schnoz. Schnoz! So how was your day? What did you guys do today? Having fun? It's the weekend. My weekend's, you know, a shot. I'm not 20 anymore, and I'm not single anymore. I got kids, so, you know, you don't really party like you used to. Party like a rock star. Nope, not anymore. I'm going to get highlighter. It's a Revlon Color Stay. You see it? Um, it says Mineral Finishing Powder in Brighton. Zero one zero. And it has like, you see that? Isn't that pretty? See? I should it, but it took me, I don't know how long to say it, so I'm proud. <laughs> Bring it down the nose. Swirl it. The cheekbones. Bring it up in that fabulous, famous V. And what is going up my camera? Crazy. Crazy for feeling. Yeah. I want to sing to you too. <laughs> Above the lip. Damn waiting. <laughs> okay. Let's do it. I want to put an eye primer on. Boing. Boing. My benefit. It's concealer. But I like to use it as an eye primer. Eye primer holds your eyeshadows. It smooths and softens out your eyelid if you got any dark veins in your eyelid or discoloration it smooths it out blends it out evens out skin tone and it makes the eyeshadow last forever and it doesn't make it creasy okay next we're going to use NARS Outlaw blush NARS Outlaw you can even see that oh my goodness that was horrible. I'm gonna use oh my goodness. Hmm. I am gonna use um the Mally brush, the double sided one, one's for highlight, one's for like a bronzer or a blush. Because I didn't bring my blusher out. I can use a dual fiber, but I'm gonna use this instead. And the outlaw. And I'm gonna put it in between the highlighter and the bronzer and just blend it together with both of them. Yeah, because you can really... This lighting with the camera didn't switch every five minutes. It would be okay. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Oh, shit. So my daughter has been sick. Ugh, poopy. I said that in the last video. And uh, she felt a little better today, but... See that? Oh, I think my camera's possessed. Crazy. Now I'm going to get um, Mac... Barbie, don't be shy. And get the same brush, put it in. Just put it kind of in the apples, but a little higher. Not like right there. I don't want to bring it there. My face, fat, fat face. You can see. Okay? That's what I like to do. Now. The Maybelline Double Wine Concealer, Double Wind, Double End, Double Something, Double Double Mint Twins, I don't know. <laughs> one's a highlighter, one's a concealer. This is a Lumine Conceal. I like to use the brush side that is the highlighter. And what I do is go under, bring it down like that. See the triangle? And then blend. Blend, blend, blend. Pat, pat, pat. And... Do you know the answer? I wish I was going to give you. I'd be like, this is a giveaway. If you know the answer why I do this, 
You will win! <laughs> I wish. We'll giveaways and all that fun stuff will be coming up soon. Once Mama gets settled here. Mama Bear. See the triangle? And if you can answer that question, I don't know. I'll do whatever video you want. <laughs> so answer that for me in the comments below. Why do I do this? The triangle pat. And why don't I rub? Why do I pat instead? You know? Let me know. It means I'm actually teaching you something. Cool. Alright. Let's do the eyes. <clears throat> Excuse me. <laughs> oh, I use this arm. I'm gonna get my brushes. I'll get my brushes together. Excuse the arm. Alright, I have the Pro Fusion palettes I told you about at Walmart. They come out at Christmas time, so they're out now, I'm sure. If you go to Walgreens and check it out. Um, I got mine after Walg um after Christmas, so I got like clearance of five dollars. So it was pretty cool. And they're great. The payoff's great. They're pigmented, they're shimmery and see that? Pretty cool, huh? They're beautiful. I mean look at let's see if I put it right here. You see that? So that's just one. There's like a ton of them. That is beautiful. Come on, five dollars? Seriously, guys. I mean, you spend what, fourteen dollars on a Mac eyeshadow? I mean, Mac eyeshadow is obviously a little bit bigger, but really, how often do you use the same Mac eyeshadow? Besides, if it's a highlight, a color like Vapor that you would use like on your lid all the time, but like the color cut ones, you only use once in a while. So like the same exact thing. My MAC eyeshadows, my palette, oh, here it goes again, my colors changing, have dried out and I'm wicked mad because I spent, you have no idea, my makeup collection, all this money in my eyeshadows dried out. So, not just in MAC, I love MAC, but still. Think about when you see eyeshadows like this at Walgreens, like, you snub it, you know, ugh, it's not MAC. Well, guess what? It's the same, much better. You know what I'm saying? All right, let's do Barbie. Sorry. Okay. Boom. Top one. The little frosty pink. Because Barbie likes pink. You can do a gray smoky eye. But it's no fun because you know Barbie's pink. Right, ladies? And gents? You know my boys. They like to dress up too. Shoot. I like always putting a light color first. I don't know why I've always done that. I know Mac um has the paints. I believe they still have them. I think it was like the cotton candy one or whatever. Oh my god, I love that. Oh, I love that one because it would be it would work like dual as a primer for my eyelids and then like an eyeshadow and I would put like a dark purple. I would always use that. Always, always. And I always used to use Mac Odyssey lipstick. Oh, it's gorgeous. Pat. Um, I'm going to work the highlighter right into it. I'm going to use this um, shimmery white one, you know, be a little dramatic. I'm sure I'm going to add more of it later. I'm just going to add it now. I'm going to do my eyebrows later. You know how I feel about eyebrows. If you don't, oh my god. I love eyebrows and everybody else on me. I hate them and I don't know why. I'm being a little dramatic with this just to let you know. It's just for fun. Just a fun tutorial. I mean, if you want to wear it out, go ahead, because I'd probably wear it out, because I'm crazy like that. If anybody that knows me, you know. The highlighting is about lift your face, and it's going to be messy right now. I always apply um, my eyeshadow like messy, and then I go back and blend it and fix it. Because you're going to mess it up anyway, so why fix it and then mess it up right up, like two minutes later, right? Alright. Let's get started with a darker pink, brighter pink. See that? What I'm gonna do is put it a little bit above my crease. Cut on the outside. See that? And I'm just using a smaller um, eyeshadow brush. Not like an angled or a contour or anything. Just like this. You can use any brush that you're comfortable with. See that? I like the hot pink colors. Living pink will probably be something from MAC that's like a dupe of this. Oh, it kind of went too far. Whoopsie. That's what I get for chit chat. I'm not paying attention. Oh, Christmas is right around the corner, huh? Scary. I have no idea. I'm going to get to for the girls. I don't know what we're going to do. My little monkeys. 